हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू आवर यूट्यूब चैनल एस एस सी सिलेक्टर्स फ्रेंड्स टूडे आई एक्सप्लेन हाउ टू कैलकुलेट द डायगोनल ऑफ अ रेगुलर ऑक्टागोन दिस रेगुलर ऑक्टागोन ए बी सी डी ई एफ जी एच एंड ईच साइड ऑफ ऑक्टागोन इज टू सेंटीमीटर एंड वी हैव टू कैलकुलेट ऑल द डायगोनल्स फॉर एग्जाम्पल देर आर थ्री डायगोनल्स ए सी CH, CG. Although there are many, but these are the three different. Uh, these are the three uh, diagonals of different length. The other diagonals are of this length only. For example, BD is equal to AC. CE is equal to AB. AC. BE is equal to CH. So distinct three distinct length diagonals are AC, CH, and CG. So let us see how to calculate the length of these diagonals. first of all we will calculate the length of ac that is this diagonal now this is 2 and this is also 2 the angle of octagon is calculated as n minus 2 into 180 upon n each angle of a regular polygon is given by n minus 2 into 180 upon n so angle abc will be equal to 8 minus 2 into 180 upon 8. That is 6 into 180 upon 8. 2 fours are 8. 2 threes are 6. 4 fours are 6. 135. So this angle is 135. If I extend this, this will be 45 degree. So this angle, extra angle is 45 degree. Similarly, if I extend this. extend this line bc this will be 45 and therefore this point the angle will be 90 degree so basically this is a right angle triangle and the length of side bc is 2 this is x and this is x because this is right angle isosceles both the angles are 45 so both the sides will be equal x and x apply the pythagoras theorem suppose i take this point as o So in triangle BOC, we can apply Pythagoras theorem. BC square is equals to OB square plus OC square. OB is x, OC is also x, and BC is two. So this is four two x square. X square is equals to four by two is two. So value of x will be under root two. So this value is root two. This value is also root two. X the value of x is one. now we have to calculate the length of ac now you can see that aoc is also a right angle triangle so in triangle aoc we can apply pythagoras theorem as ac square is equals to oa square plus oc square ac square oa is equal to ab plus ob that is 2 plus x and x is root 2 So it is equal to two plus root two whole square, and the value of OC is root two whole square. This is the length of AC. AC square is equal to a plus b whole square is a square plus b square plus two ab, and root two square is two. So this will be four plus two plus four root two plus. So AC square will be equal to four to six plus two eight eight plus four root. And if we cal uh, take out four common, it will be two plus root. So the value of AC will be under root four two plus root two. The square root of four is two, so two under root two plus root two. That is the length of diagonal AC if AB is two. by pythagoras theorem we can calculate the value of ac now let us see how to calculate the length of ch this was the length of ac which is twice under root 2 plus root that is the length of ac now let us calculate the length of ch we have to join this now in this case this line ch will be parallel to ab if we join this 
this is 90 degree. If we join this, this is also 90 degree. So basically this is a rectangle and uh, we have to calculate the length of CH. Draw perpendicular from this to CH. Draw the perpendicular from B to CH. Now we have calculated the value of OB in the previous slide. X is equal to root 2. So this length is root 2. This length is root 2. And this is a rectangle. So opposite sides will have same value. So this is also root 2. And this is root 2. This is root 2 just like this under root 2. So this value is also root 2. And this is 2. So this is also 2. This is a rectangle of length root 2 and 2. Length of CH will be equal to root 2 plus 2 plus root 2. That is 2 plus 2 root 2. This will be the length of CH. This we had calculated in the previous slide. From the value which we had calculated in, from in the previous slide, we can calculate the value of CH. 2 plus 2. Now let us calculate the value of CG. When we join CG and this is CH, as I told you just now that this is, per this is perpendicular 90 degree, the value of GH is 2 and we have calculated the value of CH as 2 plus 2 root. So this length is 2 plus 2 root and we have to calculate the value of CG. Pythagoras theorem we can apply in this because there's a right angle triangle. So CG square is equals to GH square plus HC square. GH is 2 and HC is 2 plus 2 root 2. 2 square is 4. A plus B whole square is 2 square plus 2 root 2 whole square plus twice 2 into 2 root 2. 4 plus 4 plus 2 to the 4 to the 8. 2 to the 4 to the 8 root 2. 4 plus 4, 8 plus 8, 16 plus 8 root 2. CG square. So the value of CG will be under root 16 plus 8 root 2. We can take out uh, 16 common. If we take out 16 common, the square root of 16 will be 4 under root. This will be 1 plus 1 by root 2. Because if we take out 16 from 8 root 2, it will be 8 root 2 by 16, which is 1 by root 2. So 1 plus 1 by root 2, 4. Value of CG will be 4 under root 1 plus 1 by root 2. So like this, we can calculate the length of each diagonal of a regular octagon. The first diagonal AC, the value of AC is equal to twice under root 2 plus root 2. The value of CH is 2 plus 2 root 2. And value of CG is 4 under root 1 plus 1 by root 2. Friends, I hope you like this video. Please like our video and subscribe to the channel.